Hi friends, it's Deanna here today and today we're working on another quick sew. This time I'm making a whole casual outfit. I'm going to be making the High Hopes Dolman which is so cute and so quick and so comfortable and I'm going to be using the Feel Pretty pants and I'm going to make them as shorts for this time. So these pants are awesome because it takes the same steps to make them as shorts as they do to make them as pants and as it gets colder and you want to turn them into pants not turn them into pants, but you want to make pants, you can use the same pattern, super quick, super easy. So let's get to it. All right, we're gonna start with our high hopes dolmans and what we need is our front, our back, our waistband, which is in two pieces, or two cuff bands, and our neckband. And honestly, this pattern is so easy and quick to sew because really it's just basically sewing these two pieces together and attaching all the bands. So as you can see, this is my neck band right here, my neck area right here, and here are my shoulders. Um, because it's an oversized top that comes with pretty much the sleeves already on there, it looks big, and you're gonna have to probably, quite possibly, put it on the ground, or if you have a big mat, to put it together. Um, we're gonna start by sewing our shoulders and our sides together, right sides together. Since I am one of those people that likes to do everything at the same time, we're gonna go ahead and work on our bands. I'm gonna grab my armbands, fold them right sides together along that long raw edge, and sew those up to prep them. Then I'm gonna grab my waistbands and I'm gonna face them out, put them out, face them right sides together, and sew the short raw edges together, right sides together. I'm also going to prep my band, but before I sew those short raw edges together, I'm going to steam it wrong sides together to give it a memory crease because that seems to always help me once I go to sew it on um, uh, to already have that crease on there. Once that crease is done, we're going to fold it wrong sides to right sides together and sew that short raw edge. Next, we're gonna go ahead and turn our top right side out. Look, it's pretty much all done. It just needs bands. And we're gonna do our bands. We're gonna grab all our bands and we're gonna turn them wrong sides together on those raw edges. We're doing this for all of them. We're gonna start quartering by grabbing from the back to the front, marking that quarter and then matching up the front and the back and marking those sides. There's my neck band. And then for my waistband, we're gonna fold it in half, but we already have those two seams at the sides. So those are my sides. So we just need to find the front and the back. Match up our front and back and go to the sides, well, or sides and go to the front and the back. And then for cobs, oops, I have a long tail on this one. We just need to fold them in half and I just usually mark my half because I have one half is here where the seam is and then the mark where the half is, the other half. Oh. And now we're gonna go ahead and do the same to our bodice. Here's my sleeve, already has two seams so I don't need to do anything to that and my bottom it's got the two sides, so I gotta go mark my front and my back so I can attach them evenly. And then my neckband, match those seams, then match the front and the back and go to the sides. And now we just match up our bands together, right sides together and then we sew them and we are done with our top. Now, if you need a slow down version of how to sew this top or how to sew the neckband on or anything like that, 
that just smacked me right in the face. Um, check out our other YouTube videos where we have more detailed explanation about bands and stuff like that. And it is, it will help tremendously if you're struggling with that. So we just fit them all in and match up those raw edges. All right, friends, we are done with our top. So easy and so quick. Shoulders, sides, armbands, neckband, waistband, done. So cute. I love how this pattern turns out each and every single time. I love the oversizedness of it, um, but I also just love the fit that it just drapes. I am super excited to go ahead and get our shorts done so we can have our cute little outfit. I'm using, like I said, the feel pretty short, pretty, pretty, feel pretty pants, but I'm going to do the short, um, short line. So we're gonna go ahead and make those. All right, let's get this short started. We need two backs, two fronts, two waistbands. That's it. You know, you know it when you, we have a little supplies, you know it's gonna be an easy so. So we're gonna grab just, I just cut these out in the mirror so they're still even facing each other. We're gonna go ahead and sew that crotch seam for the two fronts and then we're gonna do the same for the two backs. So let's just line them up right sides together and sew those up. It's like a smiley face. Here's half of it and then the other half is on the other side. Let's go sew it. All right, now we're gonna grab our front and our back. We're gonna open them up and place them right sides together on top of each other. And so our side seams, and we're not putting pockets on this one, but if you could, if you wanted to hack some pockets, you definitely could add some pockets to this. We do have a video on here on how to add pockets to a pattern that has side seams. Um, and you could go ahead and check that one out and add yourself some pockets. While we're at it, we're also going to sew that crotch seam right here. Look at that, my shorts are coming together. And then we're also going to grab our waistband and we're gonna match it. As you can see, I have this one piece right here. I ran out of fabric. Y'all, sometimes, sometimes, and doesn't matter. I just used my, get cut a little bit of seam allowance on there so I can sew it together and patch two pieces together. So we're gonna sew those raw edges, right sides together. All right, we are getting there. Our shorts are coming along. And now what we're going to do is, I'm turning them right side out. I'm grabbing that waistband and I'm gonna fold it right side, wrong sides together. And then I'm gonna front my front. Match those two sides together, match my, grab my front and back. All right, and now we're gonna match those up. Obviously I want that seam that I added to be in the back, so I'm looking to see the higher rise, it's the back piece, so we're gonna match those. Then we're gonna go ahead and sew this up, all the way, spin all the way around, leaving a gap where we're gonna insert our elastic. So we'll leave like a two inch gap and then we'll insert our elastic, close it, hem it, and we're done. All right, we're gonna use a big clip and we're going to insert our elastic in through that gap that we left. Once we are finally able to get that elastic out, we're going to go ahead and overlap it and zigzag stitch it together here to close it up. And then right while we're over there by the sewing machine, we're gonna put it inside and sew that seam together. And while we're over there, we're also going to go ahead and fold and hem. So you can either serge the raw edge at the bottom and then fold and hem, or you can do a quarter inch and then a quarter inch double fold and hem. So I'm gonna do that. All 
All right, friends, we are done with our outfit. I love how cute and easy this is and super, super comfortable just to get around town, run errands, do fun things. Um, I love that you can mix and match. Obviously, with these shorts, I'll be able to wear them with tons of different tops, and this top I'll be able to wear with tons of different bottoms, and I am super excited about it. It was super quick, super cute, super easy. Like I said, these bottoms, um, you can make them in the pant length. You can add pockets to them. There are so many fun things that you can do with this. Um, this is just like a basic model of to, to show you how easy it is to sew these patterns up. So if you've been on the fence and you're thinking, I kind of want to give sewing a try, I encourage you to do it. Sew yourself some beautiful garments and you will be so excited. There is nothing you can't do. You can do it. I have faith in you. I believe in you. And then if you need any extra little help, you can come find us. We have all kinds of tutorials on how to sew, how to do the PDF patterns. If you're like, how do I even print these patterns? Check out our videos on the how to section so you can see how to do all those things. And then we also have videos for each one of these patterns individually that go slower and talk about just exactly how to sew them up if you have other questions. We also have a great Facebook and Instagram family, so come find us there um, so we can help you answer questions and all those sorts of things. I hope you have a great rest of your day and I'll see you all next time.